Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Game It Out. I am Josh, and we are checking out Toe Jam and Earl back in the groove. This is the newest Toe Jam and Earl game that's been in development for a little while. A Kickstarter darling, as it were. Yo, Earl, take the wheel. I'm gonna go in the back and grab a drink. Hey, Luanda, you want something? Is this his first time seeing her? Toe Jam. I think Letitia might be thirsty too. Oh, uh, I'll get you something too, Letitia. Thanks a lot. Why are we going back to Earth anyway? Toe Jam said he wanted to impress Luanda. Wait, what? I didn't say that. Yeah, so don't blow up his game, dude. Lamont Chip. Wait, what? You took Lamont Ship without asking him? You took Lamont Ship? Yeah. Isn't that Earth right there? Wow, it's so big and so quiet. Earl, crank up the megawatt speakers and let's lay some funk on these Earthlings. All right. Yeah, get them. the base, Earl. Fire up the auxiliary mega subwoofer. Okay, um... The red button. Yeah, but, uh... Just press it. Yeah, just press okay. it. Earl, wait! No! No problem here. <laughs> I don't think it was the red button. Well, big girl, Lamont ship ain't gonna put itself back together. All right, here we are, Toe Jam and Earl back in the groove. The devs were kind enough to send a key our way, and I have fond memories of the original Toe Jam and Earl that came out on the Genesis or the Mega Drive for you European types. Wow, so many options. Is that Toe Jam's hand? Is he flipping me off? So this game does have multiplayer. We're only gonna play it single player. New game, tutorial world. Shorter and easier with hints. Be still my heart, yes. So we can do Letitia, we can do Lawanda, and our original people, Toe Jam and Earl, both in old school and not old school varieties. Okay, we're gonna go with old school Toe Jam. That's what we're gonna do. So this is what the original Toe Jam and Earl looked like. You run around as Toe Jam and or Earl. We can peep the views, bro. And I've got sick ass high tops and my amp present. And I just hit A to both. God only knows what I did. So if I hold down Y, I can see this glorious little map here. There were three Toe Jam and Earl games in total, if I recall. And the first one looked just like this, except Genesis era. So not as good animation, but charming in its own way. Fun music, all that stuff. Genesis always had great music. You hop in these elements elevators and they take you to hot new levels full of funk and groove. There are 10 pieces to your broken rap master rocket ship. It's your job to find them all. There's one somewhere on this level. That's right. Okay, I'm figuring this out. You go from level to level where there's all kinds of like odd stuff going on, but basically your goal is to find pieces to your spaceship. So the first game you crash landed on planet Earth and you had to rebuild your spaceship to get home to planet Funkotron. And the second one you go to planet Funkotron, but on your spaceship a bunch of humans have stowed aboard and so when you get to Funkotron, that like creates a problem of itself. I recall it being like a side-scroller game. But anyway, this one is clearly taking after the very first one. I'm assuming it's trying to rope in people like me who have fond memories of, hey, hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? Get away from me. What if I sneak? Nope, he's not buying it. So we need to go ahead and see if we can find our spaceship pieces and get on out of here. We can talk to friendly NPCs. If they're sparkling, they're friendly. Hello, play Smoot's Beat. Okay, X, B, X. Wow, that was really hard. Well, at least he gave me money. Hello, old carrot friend. Identify present for two bucks each? Well, I do have $6.80, but sure. Uh, I want you to identify whatever this is. Telephone, great. And this, which is an inner tube. Let's just use it and see what happens. This is kind of cute. No, you're kind of cute. That's what's up. Oh, yeah. And so I can oh, just get in, get in there. And if I wanted to, I can swim around. It's not really all that helpful here, so I'm glad I used that. Shake houses? All right. Let's look at our spaceship here. Did I just take it? The engine thingy with Finn. Oh, prize time. Just, it gives me all the good feelings. Nice job. Now it's time to find the elevator to the next level. All right, cool. Okay, so that concludes this level. We just keep on going until we have all the pieces. What's this thing? What do you think this is? Let's give it money. Who cares? Oh, another thing popped up. All right, well, I'll just keep giving it money, won't I? Ah, and now there's a door. Now the door takes me to, to uh, another part of the level. Okay, it took me to another part of the level. Uh, hello. You want to trade? I see that telephone of yours. I'll give you this show Wiseman for it. I'm not really sure what that means, but sure, why not? Thanks. So we're gonna head back to the elevator. You can see it in the bottom right corner. What do you suppose this little devil does? Hi. Oh, he hurts you. Just straight up. Hello, elevator. Let's go. Take me to level three. Wonder what happened to everyone else. Ah, it's Gandhi G, my hero. Just hanging out and flying and stuff. Hi. Gandhi G spreads love. If you stand within his circle, no one will hurt you. And what is this fever dream? Looks like this is gonna try and, yep, gonna try and hurt me. The dangers are getting more and more. Ready for promotion, find the wise men. Okay, well hang on. 
But, oh, what did I just eat? I ate something he didn't like. What's what's your deal? Buy sushi for a dollar? Yeah, that sounds like a great idea. Let's do it. Do I now have the Did I eat the sushi? When your XP bar is full and you see the Wiseman icon, go find the Wiseman for a promotion. You got it. I'll do just that. So if you hide behind these sunflowers, all the bad guys can't find you. Walk around the edges of the land to find invisible pathways. They will appear if you get close. Really? We'll see about that. Oh, okay. So if I just keep on walking... Wait, is that it? If you look down below, too, there's the previous level. Let's just fall down, see what happens. There we are. We're back on the other level, so we can fall down. Can't see that being a good thing, but at least we're back here. So all we need to do is find the elevator again. Head right back up. Okay, so we need to find the Wiseman. That's what we need to find right now. What's in this door? Let's take this door. Uh... All right, all right, all right. So we just got to hold down the thing and okay, 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 okay. So we're just going to keep on doing this. Go through all these. Oh, oh, I got stopped. Okay, cool. So there's little mini games that take you to, um, you know, your own personalized fever dream. We got all kinds of fun, funky characters here. You don't need healing. Uh, how about I just shake you a bunch? Would you like that? You know, why waste all this time? We got this thing. Let's, this will show us where the wise man is. Shows the wise man. Yep, do it. Oh. There he is. Are you the wise man? I didn't realize you were the wise man. Okay. Are you ready for a promotion? Want it now? I rank up. Congrats. You're due. I know. I know. Thanks. I don't, I don't need you to tell me that. Stats time. Okay. So we got a life bar size increase. Present skill increase. Search skill. I didn't realize there were so many stats in this game. So these presents right here, they have a chance of blowing up if we open them, which means we're totally going to open it up. Yep. Just had money in it. A lot of money. Come here, you. And also the telephone, which of course reveals random parts like a game show. Hello, superhero types. What you all doing here? Hey, wanna roll? Yeah, I want to roll. You need to roll a 14 or more. Okay, okay, here we- Oh, yes, roll again. You found the thing I care about most, and that's gambling and video games. All right, look, I need to see what happens if we win, so we're just going to keep on doing- It cost $1 to do this each time, but I need to see- There we go. All right, there we go. I made back my money. Ah, there's the ship piece. Oh, can't get too close to the hula girl, or he feels the beat. Can I talk to her? Yo, hula girl. All right, let's just get away from her. Doc Brown, what's your problem? Come back when you have broken presents. Okay, he repairs my broken presents. All right, use that. Push the button. There we go. There's another button, but we're going to pick this up first. Come here, you. Ta-da, the squishy down thingies. Lady, out of the way. I need to get to this button. Stop dancing, toe jam. Push it. Okay. Oh, God, this is just... Come on, come on, come on. Push the button, push the button, push the button. All right, there's a present over there, so let's shake this house. Okay, come here, present. Come here, present. Can I just open these? Where's... Look at all these presents I have. Let's just open it. Open. Food. Good food, not bad food. So now that we found the ship piece, we got to make it to the next level. Onward to level four. Ready for promotion? I already got all my XP again. Oh my god, there's a mall cop on, like, a Segway. Yes, I would like a promotion now, please. I'm a cabbage. There it is. Look, I found the ship piece already. The righteous rat master cockpit. Oh, we're sinking in the sand. That's no good. All right, let's get out of that. Let's identify some of these presents. Okay, identify that one. Organic power food. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Let's do a couple more. The hell with it. I don't care. Let's just identify them all. There we go. Jump to ship piece. A win the game present? Level five. Let's see what we got going on here. Oh dear. What's this? Hello. Hi there. Oh, wow. They really heard. Hello there. Shall I divine that which is hidden for only two bucks? Uh, yes, please. To, oh, whoa, wow, you really, uh, <laughs> wow. Let's equip these mean rocket skates. Oh, yeah, all right, all right. Oh, so I learned something today. If you're using the rocket shoes, all right, we'll just rocket our way back in here <laughs> like that. <laughs> so the rocket shoes, for some reason, I thought might let you fly, like, over gaps, but it just launches you with more finesse. Do I still have my rocket shoes? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, that's great. What do you suppose this is? I mean, I know it looks like a shark, but let's see. Yep, it is a shark, all right. I don't know what I was expecting. Try to imagine this with two people. If this game looks interesting to you because that can be really fun right you're both looking for ship pieces you're going to different levels i assume hello there shall i sing for three dollars uh okay why did i subject myself to this exactly do you hurt things do you kill things can you kill that thing oh wow okay i see you just kill everything you're near well excuse me i'm gonna go have a fever dream now See, there it is. It's like the ski. It's a ski part. Yep, I was right. The big ski later. And then I got a present from Gandhi, which we're going to open immediately. That's the new thing. We're just going to open presents immediately. A to flap. Okay. Can I fly so high I just go to the next level? No? No. Okay. No, you cannot. But it's nice to try. I wonder what happens when you fall, because I think it's about to run out. So let's see what happens. Uh-huh. 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 Up. Oh. Plop. Okay. Level six. Come to me, ship piece. Oh, so what's the deal with this track? I can't really tell. Ah, look, a ship piece. Yeah. We got the right wing bit thingy. Let's go up a level. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. What? 
Oh, did you see that crap? Where's it taking me now? All right, let me out, dude. Oh, <laughs> and, uh, and of course he barfs after all that. Back up we go. Thanks, Monster Elevator, for wasting all of our time. Let's use some of these sick high tops. Here we go. This is really what I've wanted is high tops that... Wait, can I jump over this? I hope I can jump this. Oh, yeah. All right, what else do we got over here? We got moldy bread. We have crazy Santa. Let's jump back over. Huh, out of the way, everybody. Okay, elevator, don't play with my heart this time, please. Okay. It's kind of funny. I have to play this game, like, really straight. Like, there's not much to really mess around with. Like, the whole point of the game is to wander around and kind of just chill out and look for stuff and be chased by sort of a purple version of the noise. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, another ship piece. Never mind what I was saying. Oh my god, we're more than halfway there. I need to get over to those other islands over there. Do you see that over to the right? Do I have any wings? I do. Let's go. And look, there's a ship piece that I can just fly to. Oh. The roundy glass part. Let's just fly our way over here here and get on out. Please don't be a monster elevator. Yes! I don't have any wings, but I do have many broken presents. You know, let's just uh, jump to ship piece. Let's do this. Whoa! Whoa! There we go. There's the ship piece. The Funkerific Coolifier. Weird looking present. Prism present, I'll call that. Let's just use it. Spring shoes. Press then release for a big jump. Okay, this won't get me killed, no question. I see the elevator. Let's go. Let's do big leaps all the way there. Come here. In we go. Let's not waste any time. Let's just go ahead Jump to ship piece. Ta-da! Ship piece. The left megawatt subwoofer. And for my troubles, I get a lot of money. What happens if I just sink in the sand? Do you think anything happens? Let me know in the comments. No, I'm kidding. We're gonna find out momentarily. Nope. He's just chilling. Oh my god. Look at that. <laughs> Hello, nightmares. There's the ship piece. There it is. There it is. There it is. I can't believe it. Oh my god. There it is. The Rap Master rocket ship. You found every piece. Congratulations on finishing the tutorial world. Beat the fixed world to see the real ending. Oh, you bastards. So I think that was a pretty good look at this game. I did take a second to dive into the fixed world to see if anything's different. There's a lot bigger land masses that you have to explore. There's also some cool things that we didn't see in the tutorial. Like one of the levels of the lights are off and it actually looks really cool when he walks around with a flashlight. And then there was like a snow level and I'm sure there's a bunch of other stuff I haven't seen either. But suffice to say, if you're already a fan of Toe Jam and Earl, I feel like this is probably pretty solid for you. It plays pretty much like I remember the original playing. And so I I think depending on if you want that or not, I think that could be really good. So that's going to do it for this episode of Let's Game It Out. As always, I am Josh. Thank you so much for joining me, and I will see you next time.